Hello, today I want to show you a cheap Sane Smart digital oscilloscope. The oscilloscope with accessories came into this small box. Uh, in the box there was a USB cable, uh, there was the scope, uh, one oscilloscope probe, also with uh, grounding crocodile, and a uh, few small accessories. Uh, like this screwdriver and uh, spare uh, tips for uh, for probe and, and this is it it's uh, very cheap approximately 100 dollars uh, uh, digital uh, oscilloscope uh, the maximum uh, frequency is 1 megahertz the sampling should be 10 mega samples per second the oscilloscope is, is really small I can compare it to to keyboard it's uh, smaller than the usual smartphone uh, okay this uh, the scope is uh, two uh, two channel there's channel a channel b there is uh, mcx connector not the standard uh, uh, bnc connectors like on big oscilloscopes there is also the wave generator which can which can generate uh, sine, uh, triangle, or square waves. The scope has only two uh, mechanical buttons. There is power button and play uh, pause for pausing the measurements. There is a micro USB connector. It's uh, it can be used for charging of internal battery or downloading uh, measured data. The very big disadvantage is missing of mechanical buttons for basic controls. The basic controls is done by this uh, touch sensitive surface. Uh, it's not so good. It's reactive sometimes good, sometimes not good. Uh, it's uh, opening submenu, it's uh, quite sometime not very well. I think I think uh, the higher model DS two zero three is is much better because it has mechanical buttons for all functions. Inside there is non replaceable lithium ion batteries battery. It uh, uh, the battery life uh, is about two hours of work uh, per one charge. Uh, there is uh, some uh, trimmers for calibration and. That's Let's quickly look to available features of this uh, digital oscilloscope. Uh, there is uh, settings for channel A and B. Uh, coupling can be set as AC or DC. Uh, there is also mathematical channel C. Uh, you can select. Uh, uh, you can uh, you can show uh, the recorded uh, measurements or you can. You can show the A minus B or A plus B or inversion of A or B. Uh, the come on, I want to go back. This this touch panel is really really horrible. Uh, time base you can set it from one microsecond to two seconds. Uh, there is cursors. Uh, and on the next page there is settings of measurements the possible measurements uh, there is minimum voltage maximum average peak peak voltage duty cycle uh, and frequency uh, there is no uh, no Fourier transformation uh, no I, uh, I square C bus decoding or uh, no advanced feature like like this. Uh, you can save uh, the measurements uh, as bitmap or CSV file. And the, I think the very useful thing, very useful feature, is wave generator. Come on. Yes, you can select, for example, sign frequency. Uh, I also checked the output of this wave generator on 
big oscilloscope with 20 MHz bandwidth. Okay, the sine wave you can set it till uh, 20 kHz, but usable without uh, much distortion. It's uh, approximately until 5 kHz. Uh, and this is this is almost all. So from my point of view, uh, I think the real better is uh, the higher model DS203 uh, uh, because it has mechanical buttons and also there is there is bigger community there is alternative firmware which can uh, which, which adding uh, fast Fourier transformation uh, serial bus decoding and and etc